we've got a couple of intriguing NFL stories happening right now. Ray well, Rice. I'll be the judge of that. Okay, Ray Rice uh, has written a letter to the fans apologizing for his behavior, that domestic violence situation. And uh, the Minnesota Vikings owner has said he wants Adrian Peterson back, despite what he went through with the... Uh, the uh, alleged assault of his four-year-old son. So let's start with Ray Rice. In fact, l let me read you a graphic, okay, um, from Ray Rice. This is his apology that he submitted to the Baltimore Sun to uh, all of the fans. I'm truly sorry for letting you down, but I hope it's helped you learn that one bad decision can turn your dream into a nightmare. There is no excuse for domestic violence, and I apologize for the horrible mistake I made. On the positive side, he brought more attention to domestic violence yeah. than anybody has in probably maybe forever. Uh, Adam Schefter is reporting yeah. that um, there are at least four teams interested in Ray Rice. Should a team be interested in Ray Rice? Uh, uh, well, I'm going to ta answer that question two different ways. One, let's assume that that was an isolated incident because we have no proof of previous incidents. Okay. Is, is that right? So we don't know. We don't know. We don't know whether that was because of circumstances of alcohol in Atlantic City and what was going on with um, him and then his uh, fiance or girlfriend. I think there are teams out there that if they will sign an offensive lineman, as the Buffalo Bills did, Richie Incognito, that they will give Ray Ray Rice a second opportunity. I wouldn't sign him because I, I wouldn't. I mean, if it were me in charge, I don't want that. I don't want that that air around the yeah. situation. But his career was. His career was pretty dead the year before. Well, yeah, he only ran so for when, when 660 about, yards yeah, why, in 2013. Why really? I mean, he's 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 running that quarter that running back age where you're used up. Chris Johnson comes to mind. Chris yeah. Johnson can't play anymore. It really happens. So I I, I think it nobody. I mean, he, he, somebody will sign him, but I don't think there's much left in his career. Well, I, I, Adrian I, I, Peterson, yeah. I think, can go back to the Vikings. People will accept him. Yeah, he made a mistake in how he. How his family made a mistake and how he was treated as a kid, and he passed that along to his kids, and that's not right. And sometimes we just have to say my, our parents were wrong in how they did things. My mother was wrong in trying to make me eat everything on my plate. We found that that's not right, but she was taught by her. And so you should have grown up. You should have grown up in my house. If I didn't have third helpings, my mom would say, "What? You don't like my food?" Yeah. And I always used to say, well, if people are st starving in China, why can't we s put this in a box and send it to them and let them pass it around? Because I don't want Brooklyn, uh, Brussels sprouts. Adrian Peterson's going to resign with, with the Vikings, and people will, ever <coughs> will accept him. And he does have some, something left in his career. He was the most valuable player uh, over Peyton Manning two seasons ago. If you go back three seasons. Yeah, two, well, two years ago, he ran for almost 1,300 yards, and that was with missing two games. So Adrian Peterson's got a lot he's left in the got, tank, even yeah. though he's a year older than Ray Rice. But, look, I, I'm a forgiving guy, and I think we're a forgiving nation, and I think we're always willing to give somebody a second chance. Uh, if these guys have paid their dues, if they've served their punishment, which it looks like they have, um, why not allow them to continue making a living? What are you going to do? Keep them from making a living? They're 28 and 29 years old. they got a lot of life left to live. So Ray Rice, though, from a football standpoint, I would not, I would not bring in Ray Rice. Um, the Baltimore Ravens showed that they could replace him easily by bringing in Forsett, who had a better season this year than Rice had last year. Uh, plus, yeah, you're right. You do have that whole circus around it. It's going to happen. It just does when he enters camp. Adrian Peterson, you know, I, I think people don't take it, don't hold it against Adrian Peterson as much. And I think a lot of that has to do with the fact we saw the Ray Rice video. And it was stark, man. It was it was eye opening. We didn't see the Adrian Peterson video, so not that it it makes what he did any less worse, but we don't have that embedded in our mind. So we're probably more likely to forgive Adrian Peterson for what he did.